Yeah, Kim, all of this information coming down in the last 30 minutes or so. So we know that this park closure is going to be temporary and it'll start a week from tomorrow. So September 15th today we've been out here all day and we saw crews bring out these pieces of fencing and we know that tomorrow the city says they're going to post official notice of this closure again starting September 15th. We're hearing over the past several weeks, the Denver Department of Public Health and Environment and Parks and Rec. They've been monitoring conditions here at the park. They say excessive amounts of trash have piled up every day. There's rotten food, human waste, things like used needles. We saw all of that ourselves today at the park. The city says the park and areas nearby have become a hot spot for violence, crime and people selling drugs. And for all of those reasons, the park is going to be closed. The city says it has a long list of restoration work, things like fixing the turf out here, mitigating a big rat problem, trimming the trees and adding lighting to the park. Mayor Michael Hancock also tweeted about this afternoon. He says that the challenges here at Civic Center Park had reached a tipping point and it was threatening public health and safety. Guys, as far as a timetable for the closure, the city has not given us that. They have simply said that it will be closed until further notice and after all of this restoration work is done. And Noel, you touched on it. This has been an ongoing issue that has been brought up before with the city. It certainly has. We've seen issues with the areas surrounding the Capitol, with people who are experiencing homelessness out there, and the Denver Department of Public Health and Environment coming in and closing off some of those areas due to a, a public health crisis, they say. This seems like it's similar, but it's at a larger scale, right? We're talking about all of Civic Center Park. They're going to be closing it down starting Wednesday, September 15th. All right. Well, more information must be shared, I, we assume, down the road as they talk about long-term plans. Thank you, Noel.